Peppa Pig Tales. Let's jump in! Today, Peppa and her friends are playing games at Playgroup. A pocket full of poses. A tissue! A tissue! We all fall down! <laughs> the bump has made Gerald Giraffe's marble roll into Candy Cat and Danny Dog's dominoes. And Zoe Zebra's blocks have landed on a xylophone. Everything has tumbled down. <laughs> that was amazing! Let's do it again! But let's make it even bigger! Peppa and her friends are making the tumble down track even bigger. Let's make it taller! Yeah! yeah. Let's make it faster! <laughs> <laughs> The tumble down track is finished. So now it's time to make Yay! everything tumble down again. Ready, steady, go! Yay! <laughs> oh no! Phew. Oh! The tumble down track didn't tumble down very well at all. It just made a mess. And not a fun one. It's okay. We just need to fix it and make it a little smaller. Yay! Yay! Peppa and her friends have put everything back in place, but with a few important changes. <laughs> So now they're ready to try the tumble down track again. Ready, steady. Ready to go, Peppa. Ah! The marble has rolled down the run and into the dominoes. And the dominoes have knocked the bouncy balls onto the instruments. Look at that. And pushed the toy car into the books. Which has given Daddy Pig a delicious snack. Oh, thanks very much. Mmm. Peppa and her friends love making things tumble down, and Daddy Pig loves bananas. Mmm. Peppa Pig and Danny Dog are driving a train full of gold, silver and... Broccoli! <laughs> Is broccoli treasure? Yes. It's special broccoli made of sparkly diamonds. Peppa and Danny aren't really driving a train. They're using their imagination to pretend. <gasps> oh no! Pedro Pony and Susie Sheep are pretending to be train robbers. Can we have all your treasure, please? <laughs> no. Oh, okay. <laughs> You're supposed to steal the treasure, Susie. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Now Peppa and Danny are pretending to be police officers. They're going to catch the robbers. Oh. You caught us. No, we didn't. Because, um... Ha! Huh. 
Your mm. boat can fly. Whoa. Um, Madam Gazelle, can ships fly? Real ships cannot fly. Oh. But pretend ships certainly can. Hooray! Wow! Now Pedro and Susie are in a flying boat. Oh, um... <gasps> Our train can fly too. Whee! Police officers Pepper and Danny have almost caught the robbers. <gasps> oh, I'm dying. Oh. <gasps> Is it a giant? <gasps> no, it's a daddy pig. And he's coming to take you home. <laughs> Charge! <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing, Peppa? We're pretending to fly our boats and trains, Daddy. <laughs> oh, my! What an imaginative bunch you all are! Oh, aha! Peppa loves imagining things. Everyone loves imagining things. Peppa and Susie are pretending to be police officers. Police officers. You're welcome. Now we must get back to solving crimes. Nino! Nino! Oh my! What is it, Madam Gazelle? I think my special pen has gone missing. <gasps> this sounds like a mystery. Ah. Don't worry, me and police officer Susie will solve the case. <laughs> Peppa and Susie are looking for clues to find the special pen. They're using a magnifying glass to make small things look bigger. Aha! Purple. That's the oh. same colour oh. as Danny oh. Dog's T-shirt. <gasps> Have you seen oh. the special pen, Danny? I don't think so. Well... We'd better take you to the police station to ask you some questions. Peppa and Susie have made a pretend police station so they can ask everyone questions about the missing pen. <laughs> it's made from books and pillows. This police station doesn't even have doors. It's a nice place to read, though. Peppa and Susie are asking everybody about the special pen. Oh. They've brought Candy Cat to the pretend police station. Candy Cat, can you remember what colour the special pen is? Hmm, red? No, green. Actually, pink. No, uh, blue. Aha, uh -huh. you've been very helpful. Let's take a big look around. The special blue pen must be <gasps> hidden somewhere. Pepper and Susie are searching everywhere for the special pen. Ah! Oh, but they can't find it anywhere. <laughs> I can't find it anywhere. Hmm. I have an idea. Now, Madam Gazelle is answering questions at the pretend police station. When did you last see your pen, Madam Gazelle? Well, let's see. I used it this morning, then I put it behind my ear. Oh, my! Yay! Madam Gazelle's special <laughs> pen has been behind her ear all along. We found it! <laughs> we solved the mystery! <laughs> Hooray! Thank you for helping me, Peppa and Susie. I think you would make very good police <gasps> officers. <laughs> Today, Mummy Pig has brought Peppa and George for a special <laughs> visit to the toy shop. Hello. I'm looking for a mummy and two little ones for a special toy shop treat. Have you seen them? <gasps> That's us! Is it? Well, what are you waiting for? Let's go! Hooray! This Whoa. is where you're able to create your very own special toy. Ooh. Just swipe through to choose. You could pick a robot or a princess or a silly monster or a... <gasps> Dino! 
Tiny Shoe! <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know you liked dinosaurs. Tiny Shoe! Tiny Shoe! Tiny Shoe! <laughs> George loves dinosaurs. They're his favourite. I guess we know what he'll be making. Have fun! Yay! Ooh, <laughs> good choice. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> a spaceman. A monster. A superhero. Peppa and George <laughs> love making their own toys. They both like very different things. Mine is a robot. Dinosaur. Fantastic. Now with a little toy shop magic. <laughs> The machine will make your toys! Lovely! <laughs> now, you just need to pick an outfit for your toys. <laughs> there are lots of different outfits to choose from, but Peppa and George think oh. these outfits are perfect for their new toys. <laughs> Hooray! <gasps> perfect! In they go! Oh dear, the toy machine has put the wrong clothes on the toys. The machine mixed up their clothes, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> oh, yes. Ah, oh, well, they still look like fun toys to me. And very creative. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Flying is fun. Whee! <laughs> Wait for us, Peppa. Whee! Wow, what is this room? This is a special new toy machine. Whoa. Just stand here in the middle, Peppa. <laughs> what is it doing? Stay still! What was that? <gasps> Ta-da! The machine has made a little toy that looks just <laughs> like Pepper. Look, George, I'm tiny! <laughs> Whee! <laughs> <gasps> and so are you! <laughs> Pepper and George love making toys in the toy shop, but George really loves being a toy too. Today, Peppa and Mummy Pig are riding the bumper cars yeah. at Potato City. Can't catch me, Rebecca! <laughs> oh, yes, I can! <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Peppa! We found a new ride! It's a water ride! <laughs> it's so splashy! I love splashy rides! Splashy? Mummy Pig isn't sure she loves splashy rides. Uh, why don't we go on a ride without splashes? Like, uh, oh, this bench! Ooh, what fun! Whee! <laughs> we can go on that after. Come on, Mummy! Yay! <laughs> Everyone has arrived at the new water ride. Celery Stick Falls. Uh-oh! <laughs> oh, it is very splashy. Very, very splashy. <laughs> Adults in the front, please. That means you, Mummy Pig, right here. Oh, right. Um, okay. Enjoy the ride. <laughs> Oh. oh, this is quite lovely. Whee! The ride is going very high up. Splash, splash, splash. We all love to splash. Uh, uh, not everyone loves to splash. You who? <laughs> Would you like a small splash, a big splash, or a humongous splash? Um, a Hugmonger Splash, please! Yeah. Yeah. No. Okie dokie! Ready? Yeah. Yes! No. Five against one. <gasps> Off you go! The celery stick falls are very fast and very splashy. <laughs> there we are. Nice and dry. No, oh, not again! <laughs> Was amazing! <laughs> and very, very splashy! <laughs> Mummy, what are you doing? 
The splashes were... Amazing! Let's go again! Now Mummy Pig loves humongous splashes. Everyone loves humongous splashes. Peppa Pig and her friends are at the aquarium today. They're all pretending to be fish. <laughs> What's that? <gasps> this is an octopus. It has eight long wibbly wobbly legs. Ooh. Actually, an octopus only has two wibbly wobbly legs. The other six are wibbly wobbly arms. Rip wobb, rip wobb, rip wobb, rip wobb. <laughs> I wish I had a rainbow tail. <gasps> Let's be mermaids, Susie. <laughs> but we don't have mermaid tails. But we can pretend. <laughs> <laughs> Hooray! Peppa Whee! and Susie are pretending they are mermaids with long, lovely tails. Hello, seahorses. We can swim around just like you. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> it's so pretty! What is it? This is an oyster. <laughs> it has a pearl inside. <gasps> a pearl? What's a pearl? It's a very lovely shiny object. Can we open it and see it? An oyster only opens when it's ready, so we'll just have to be patient. Hmm. I can't see Excuse me, Mr Oyster. Can you open, please? We're being really patient. <laughs> Can you go, ah, like at the dentist? Hmm. Um. Boom! <gasps> oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's not working. <gasps> it's so tickly. <laughs> Let's tickle it open. Mermaid Pepper and Mermaid Susie are trying to tickle the oyster so it'll open. They tickle and tickle and tickle, but the oyster still won't open. It's not working. We'll never see the pearl. We'll just have to wait. <sighs> It's the pearl! It's so pretty! <laughs> the oyster has finally opened. The pearl inside is very lovely indeed. Aww. Rip wob, rip wob! But I want to see the pearl. Can we make it open, please? <laughs> no, Danny. Oh. We have to be patient. Everyone knows that being patient can be tricky. But Peppa and Susie know that the very lovely pearl will be worth the wait. Hooray! <laughs> Today, Peppa is going to Rebecca Rabbit's bar. Bye, Mummy! <laughs> <clears throat> Today, Peppa is already at Rebecca Rabbit's burrow. She's come to play a new Whoa. video game called Carrot Catcher. Do you want to play? Yes, please. I'm amazingly, really excellent at games. Oh, dear. Pepper doesn't know how to begin the game. Um, I am amazingly, really excellent at games. But maybe it would be more fun if you started the game, Rebecca. <laughs> oh, yes. I knew that. <laughs> First, you pick your bunny. Then you hop around and catch the carrots. Oh, yes. Um... Uh, uh. Peppa is amazingly really excellent at video games, but she might need a bit of help with this one. Uh, how do you catch the carrots, please, Rebecca? Like this. <gasps> Yay! I'm good at this. <laughs> oh. My turn! <laughs> wow! <laughs> Rebecca Rabbit is amazingly really excellent at this game. Wow! You're really good at catching carrots, Rebecca. 
I've had lots of practice. Do you want to play together now? We can be a team. <gasps> yes! Woohoo! <laughs> Got it! Yay! Here's one! There's one! Whee! <laughs> New high score! Hooray! Peppa and Rebecca make a very good team. Rosie! Robbie! What are you doing? <laughs> Hello, you two! Have you seen the twins? They've run off with our lunch! <gasps> we'll catch them! We're good at catching carrots! <laughs> and baby bunnies! <laughs> Band one! Rosie! <laughs> gotcha! Here's another one! Robbie! Got it! Mmm! Still good! Pepper and Rebecca are very good carrot catchers. Yay! Hooray! Lunch is saved! <laughs> See you! <laughs> In fact, Pepper and Rebecca are amazingly, really excellent carrot catchers. Today, Pepper and her family are at the supermarket. They're going to pay for their shopping at the till. Huh? Sorry, got to nip to the loo. Use the self-checkout if you like. <laughs> the self-checkout lets you scan and pay for your shopping all by yourself. It's a big shopping <laughs> robot. <laughs> Would you two like to scan the shopping? Yes, please. Hello, customers. Hello, shopping <laughs> robots. Please place bags in the bagging area. Um... Bag! <laughs> Yes, George. Mummy's handbag is a bag. This bag is the wrong bag. <laughs> the shopping robot needs shopping bags. This bag is the right bag. Yay! Please scan shopping. Beep. Peppa and George like scanning the shopping. Beep. Item not scanned. Try again. Oh, um, beep. Item still not scanned. Try again. There is a rather long queue waiting to use the shopping robot. Item not scanned. Hmm. It's not working. Item not scanned. Item not scanned. Item, 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 items scanned. Yay! Please put ten cartons of juice in the bagging area. Ten? We don't need that much juice. Um, cancel juice. More juice <gasps> added. Please put 60 cartons of juice no, in the bagging cancel, area. Cancel. Hmm. Oh, this should do it. Oh. Oh. Mummy Pig is very good with computers and shopping robots. How do we beat this, Mummy? The pineapple doesn't have a little sticker to scan. We have to find it on the screen. Oh. Pine cones? No. Pine nuts? No. Ah, pineapple. Here we go. Yay! <laughs> Item is too light. Oh. Um, how about now? <laughs> Item too heavy. Error, 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 error. This one. Error. 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 How about now? And now. Press the button on the side. Everyone in the supermarket is trying to help. Too many errors. Oh. oh no! The shopping robot is broken. Sorry, everyone. I'm back. Who's next? Me. 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 Oh, terrific! Everyone loves going shopping. Please scan oh. shopping. But not everyone loves the shopping robot. Today, Peppa and her classmates are visiting a chocolate factory. Can I try some chocolate, please, Miss Rabbit? You can, Peppa. Yay! But we've got to make it first. Oh. <laughs> Peppa is very excited to make chocolate. How do we make it, Miss Rabbit? With this machine. Hello, machine. Can you make me some chocolate, please? <gasps> Thank you, machine. Yay! 
Now can I try some of it, please? Not yet, Pepper. We need to decorate it first. Follow me! Hooray! Everyone is very excited to decorate the chocolate too. You can decorate one chocolate bar each. Ooh, it looks like a muddy puzzle. <laughs> yes, but don't jump in it, Peppa. And you can add whatever decorations you like from the table as long as it's yummy. Mine is a carroty chocolate bar. <laughs> Delicious! Mine is a cheesy chocolate bar. Squeak! Yum, yum! And mine is a spaghetti chocolate bar. Oh. Because strawberry laces look like spaghetti. <laughs> Phew! Scrumptious! Can I try some chocolate now, please, Miss Rabbit? Almost, Pepper. The chocolate needs to cool in the fridge first. The fridge is very cold and makes the liquid chocolate oh. harden into bars. And done. Yay! Oh. Can we please try some chocolate now, Miss Rabbit? Not yet, Pep. Oh, wait. Yes, you can. <gasps> Hmm, is something wrong, Peppa? No, I just really liked it when the chocolate was all runny like a muddy puddle. Ho oh, oh. ho, then it's lucky I have one more treat for you Yay! all. It's a chocolate fountain! It's just like a giant chocolate muddy puddle. And lots of nice, healthy fruit to dip to. Thank you, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> Pepper loves muddy puddles, especially when they're made out of chocolate. <laughs> Today is Ooh. pancake day, so Peppa and her family oh. are eating at a fancy pancake restaurant. Ooh. I'll be your chef today. Oh. I make the pancakes oh. right at your table Whoa. and you get to help. What kind of pancakes can we make? Any you can think of. We have lots of yummy ingredients. I'll have the special mushroom pancake, please. One banana-licious banana pancake with extra bananas for me, please. Coming right up. <laughs> Miss Rabbit is good at making pancakes. <laughs> Thank you. Now a little colour. Then add the mushrooms. Bananas and extra bananas. Ooh. And now for the best bit. Smelling? Eating? Yeah. Flipping it! Exactly! Woohoo! Miss Rabbit is very good at making pancakes. Whoa! Ha! <laughs> Ta da! <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Mmm! Phew! Now, what would you two like in your pancakes? I would like a chocolatey chocolate pancake. With chocolate, please! <laughs> you clearly have a sweet tooth. And you, George? <laughs> oh. Peas and tomato for George. And pineapple, coconut, cabbage. Hmm. And this. No, that's oh. red hot chilli. Peppa. <laughs> Peppa and George like all kinds of ingredients on their pancakes and lots of them. Ta-da! Want to help me flip? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> now, on the count of three, we'll give them a gentle little flip. One, two... Flip! Peppa and George have flipped their pancakes Whoa! very high and onto <laughs> Mr Bull's plate. Oh, yummy! Mmm! Tore very much! Mmm! It's sweet! Mm, and savoury, crunchy, and ooh, spicy, oh. ooh, delicious. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> 
It's a special surprise pancake. Oh, mm. pancake? <laughs> Peppa and George love making super special surprise pancakes. Looks like we'll have to make another for you two. Yay! Yay! <laughs> but they really love eating them when they're done. <laughs> Today, Peppa and George are at a fun fair. <laughs> Hi, Peppa. Have you been in the fun house yet? What's a fun house? It's a special fun fair house that has lots of silly rooms and funny hallways. <laughs> Can me and George go into the fun house, please? Please. Hello, Miss Rabbit. Two for the fun house. To enter the fun house, Mummy Pig must buy tokens from Miss um... Rabbit. But the tokens cost more coins than Mummy Pig thought. Oh. Thank you, Mummy Pig. Right this way. <laughs> Hooray! Ooh! This is the rickety rackety bridge. Pass through to see the rest of the fun house. <laughs> Peppa is moving very slowly and carefully across the bridge. But George thinks it's fun to go very fast. <laughs> Your way is much better, George. Whee! <laughs> Congratulations! Now you need to follow the arrows. This way, George. <laughs> <laughs> These mirrors are so wobbly. The funhouse mirrors make Peppa and George look very silly indeed. This mirror makes me look so tall. And you look like you have a very big head, George. <laughs> that one makes you look really round. Round! And this mirror makes me look like Miss Rabbit. That's because I am Miss Rabbit. <gasps> <laughs> Follow me to the twisty, turny tunnel. <laughs> the funhouse tunnel spins round and round. Ooh! Whee! And it's very windy. <laughs> <laughs> Look! After the tunnel, we get to go down the slide. Yay! <laughs> I'll help you, George. <laughs> I wonder what's taking so long. I hope they're not lost. <laughs> How was it? The fun house was really fun. How fitting. Everyone loves the fun house because the fun house is very... Hooray! <laughs> 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 oh! oh. Aha! Uh -huh. There's one! Hooray! <gasps> Today, Peppa and her family have come to the shopping centre. Oh. Perhaps we'll get out here. I'll park up and find you soon. <laughs> if I can find a space. They've come to the toy shop to find a gift for baby Alexander. There's so many toys! <laughs> Yay! Now what do we think baby Alexander will like? Hmm. <gasps> Maybe this basketball. Or this blaster. Pop, pop. <laughs> or this karaoke machine. <laughs> karaoke! <laughs> <laughs> These are very fun, but I'm not sure they're right for a baby. Then we'll have to keep looking. <laughs> <laughs> <gasps> <Whee! laughs> Daddy Pig has finally found a space in the car park. Ah. Oh dear. But the parking space is so small, he can't get out of the car. I'll just have to go around again. Whee! Found, George. It's like the car park we were in. Car park! <laughs> George loves the toy car park. Up, up, up! Baby Alexander <laughs> does like cars, but I think he is too <laughs> young for this toy. Oh! What about this ball, George? No! Up, up, up! 
Or maybe this cuddly teddy. No! Whee! George doesn't think any of these toys are right for baby Alexander. <laughs> what about this noisy rattle? <laughs> no! <laughs> boom! Boom! George only <gasps> likes the toy car park. <laughs> <laughs> Look at <gasps> this, George. No! <laughs> for you. What a perfect gift for baby Alexander. We'll take it, please, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> I wonder where Daddy Pig parked. Whee! Hello, everyone. <laughs> everyone loves going toy shopping. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> but Daddy and George really love the car park. Whee! <laughs> <laughs> Yummy, tasty food. Yummy, tasty Today on the cruise, food. Peppa and her family are at a very special ah. type of restaurant. This is a special type of restaurant called a buffet. Just take a plate and choose the food you want to eat. Enjoy! Oh, oh goody! The restaurant mm. buffet has lots of different foods to choose from. What would you like to eat, Peppa? Spaghetti is my favourite. Right you are. But we mustn't take too much. We can always come back and get some more. Oh, good idea. <laughs> and what would you like, George? Juice! Thirsty, are you? <laughs> I think we can rustle up some orange <laughs> juice. Let's see here. Aha! Ooh. The orange juice machine is very loud. And it hasn't made very much orange juice at all. Oh. We'll just have to make some more. Delicious. I can't wait to... Finished. Oh. Mm. <laughs> you were hungry, Pepper. Can I get some more now, please? Oh. Of course. Let's go. Hooray! Grandpa Pig is still trying to make George a cup of orange juice. Oh, dear. Could we have some more oranges, please, Miss Rabbit? Right away. Ooh. Pepper has found a very special pancake machine. Just one pancake, please, Mr. Robot. I can always come back and get more. Mm -hmm. Splendid. Aha! Granny Pig is ah. very excited ah. to eat her spaghetti. Ah. Finished. Oh. Thank you, Pancake Robot. But now, Peppa is thirsty mm. too. Can I get some juice as well, Granny? Of course. Grandpa Pig can get you some. I do wonder what's ah. taking him so long. Mmm. <gasps> Grandpa Pig has finally made a <gasps> cup of orange juice. <laughs> In fact, Grandpa Pig has made lots of cups of orange juice. Oh. The machine has finally stopped ah. making oh. orange juice. Phew. Silly Grandpa. You don't need to make all the juice. You can always come back and get more. Peppa loves the buffet restaurant. Mm. And George really <laughs> loves orange juice. Today, Peppa and her family have been at the supermarket. Outside the supermarket is a toy machine. Yay! Ooh! Mandy Mouse has got a toy. Look, Mummy! A yo-yo! Well done, Mandy. Peppa, George, would you like a go on the toy machine? Yes, please. How does it work, Miss Rabbit? You just buy a token and put it in the slot. Then a ball rolls all the way down to the bottom of the machine and there's a <laughs> special surprise toy inside. Dinosaur! George would like to get a dinosaur toy. How fun! You can have one try each. Here you go. Yay! 
<laughs> Yay! George's token makes the machine light up and play music. A ball rolls all the way down to the bottom. George has got a toy screwdriver. A screwdriver! How useful! Dinosaur! Don't worry, George. I'll try to get the dinosaur too. Now, Pepper's token <laughs> makes the machine light up and a different ball rolls all the way down to the bottom. <laughs> oh. Pepper hasn't got the dinosaur, but she has got some very nice stickers. What lovely toys you got. <gasps> but look, our ice cream is starting to melt. So close. I have a feeling the dinosaur will come out next time. <laughs> Please, can we have one more go, Mummy? Please? <laughs> oh, go on then. <laughs> one more try. Hooray! <laughs> Pepper and George pull the lever on the toy machine. But this time, no balls pop out. Oh. oh dear. I wanted to see what toy you were going to get. Not to <gasps> worry, Mummy Pig. I can fix it. I just need to find my screwdriver. Nope. Nope. Screwdriver. <gasps> ah, thank you, George. <gasps> Oh, whoops! <laughs> Miss Rabbit has fixed the machine too much. Now all the balls have fallen out. I'd better put these back, but I think you earned this for helping me fix the machine. <gasps> Dinosaur! <laughs> Thank you, Miss Rabbit. This is for you. Eh? <gasps> <laughs> Everyone loves the toy machine and George really loves dinosaur. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her friends have come to a special adventure park. Come on, Edmund, you can do it. It's really fun. Well done, Edmund. This room has a balance beam. You have to walk across it without falling into the ball pit. If you all keep working as a team, you'll get all the way through without falling into the ball pits. I'm good at balancing. Follow me. Now, George, Pepper, and Edmund Elephant must cross the balance beam. But Edmund is finding the balance beam a bit difficult. Try going sideways, Edmund. We can do it together. Hooray! Everyone has made it across the balance beam. Now they must swing across this room. This looks tricky. It's just like the swing in the park, Emily. Watch this. Whee! Peppa is very good at swinging. Hooray! Hold on tight, George. Whee! <laughs> Here you go, Edmund. But Edmund Elephant is feeling a little nervous about it. Why don't we go together, Edmund, as a team? Good idea! Whee! Hooray! We did it! Thank you, Emily! Everyone has made it across the big swing. Good teamwork, everyone. One room to go. <laughs> this is the final Whoa. room, but there is no way across the ball pit. We can't jump that far. And there's nothing to swing on. Ho, ho, ho. This room is a bit of a puzzle. <gasps> Nobody knows how to solve the puzzle and get across. Oh. I've got it. But Edmund Elephant is very <gasps> good at puzzles. <laughs> I'm a clever clogs, you know. 
<laughs> Everyone has made it through the adventure park. That was very clever, Edmund. <laughs> Edmund? And Edmund Elephant can't wait to do it all over again. Pretty cool, eh, Pepper? <laughs> Daddy, we're getting shoes for George, not you. Oh, yes. Today, George is buying <laughs> some new shoes. Hello, Miss Rabbit. We need some new shoes for George. <laughs> George's shoes are very old. Well, you're in luck. The shoe shop has lots <gasps> of shoes. We'll find George the perfect pair. First, we need to measure your feet. Pop your foot in the measurer, please. <laughs> Miss Rabbit is measuring George's feet to help him find shoes that are the right size. Your feet are very small. That's because George is a baby. <laughs> no. George is not a baby. Follow me. <laughs> oh. We keep all our very small shoes over here. Which shoes do you like, George? Shoes! Those are bowling shoes. George loves to go bowling. And he loves bowling shoes. Are you sure you want those shoes, George? <laughs> shoes! Shoes! Those are tap dancing shoes. George loves to make lots of noise. Maybe too noisy. <laughs> shoes! They are clown shoes. Uh -huh. George oh. loves clown oh. shoes. Whoa. <laughs> They're too big. And George is very small. Uh, uh, shoes! Shoes! <laughs> George tries on lots of shoes. Tall ones. Little ones. And even silly ones. But none of them are quite right. Shoes! Dinosaur! They are slippers, George. They are not shoes. <laughs> shoes! These are just like your old <gasps> shoes. Shoes! George would like <gasps> new shoes that are just <laughs> like his old shoes. Jolly good. We'll take them, please, Miss Rabbit. Miss Rabbit? Phew! I'm under here! Oh. Shoes! <laughs> George loves his new shoes and he loves the shoe shop. Everyone loves the shoe shop. Today, Mummy and Pepper have brought George Yay! to the doctor's for a checkup. <laughs> Hello, I'm Dr. Pepper Pig. <laughs> Hello, Dr. Pepper Pig. I'm Nurse Miss Rabbit. <laughs> and this is Dr. Brown Bear. Ready for your checkup, George? No! George <gasps> has never been to the doctor's before. He is a little nervous. Don't worry, George. The doctors just want to make sure you feel good. Exactly. Come on in and don't forget your little red book. <laughs> First, Miss Rabbit and Dr Brown Bear need to check George's height. <gasps> Step this way, please, George. No! But George isn't sure he'll like the height measurer. <laughs> How tall am I, Miss Rabbit? Wow! You're getting very tall, Peppa. You'll be a big grown-up mm -hmm. soon. <laughs> George wants to know if he is very tall too. Wow! You're so big and tall, George. <laughs> now it's time to check George's weight with a special machine called scales. This 
this machine will tell us how much you weigh, George. And it's really good <laughs> for bouncing. <laughs> George loves bouncing. <laughs> <laughs> and freeze. <gasps> Mm hmm. And unfreeze. <laughs> <laughs> now it's time to listen to George's heart with a special tool called a stethoscope. Oh. Oh. Mm. This might be a little cold. <laughs> the stethoscope is very cold. Oh. Try this, George. You can listen to my heartbeat too. George likes listening to Peppa's heart. <laughs> Yay! You did very well today, George. So you get a sticker. Oh. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> and one for Dr Pepper Pig for being so helpful too. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> Today, Pepper and George are playing grown-ups. Oh gosh, oh gosh, where is my bag and my hat? We're off to work now, Mummy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and what job do you think you'd enjoy when you're grown up? Dinosaur! George <laughs> wants to be a dinosaur. Hmm, I think I would enjoy being a dentist. Then I will make sure everyone's teeth are nice and healthy. Hmm, interesting. Uh, 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 hang all right. You've got lots of clean teeth, Mummy. Oh. Here's a sticker for being so brave. Don't forget to brush your teeth. Who's next? <laughs> Silly George. Dinosaurs don't go to the dentist. <laughs> they go to Dr Hamster the vet. But you can have a sticker anyway. I think you'd make a very good dentist. <laughs> and you'd be an excellent dinosaur, George. But I'd also like to be a bus driver. Then I could take all my friends to the park. Tickets, please. Next stop, the <laughs> park. Stop! <gasps> you forgot us! Come back! <laughs> vroom! Vroom! <laughs> <laughs> you have to stop at all the bus stops if you want to be a bus driver, Peppa. Oops, <gasps> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I think you'd be a brilliant bus driver, Peppa. But I don't just want to be a dentist and a bus driver. I also want to be a teacher. Oh. <laughs> then I'll teach everybody how to paint. You can paint a butterfly using handprints like this. <gasps> <laughs> Dinosaurs don't go to school, George. Perhaps you could open a school for dinosaurs. But when I'm grown up, I also want to jump in muddy puddles. <laughs> <laughs> and George will be a dinosaur. And they will always <laughs> love jumping in muddy puddles, <laughs> even when they are grown up or dinosaurs. <laughs> It is bedtime, but George isn't sleeping, so neither are Peppa or Daddy Pig. What now? We've already read every bedtime story. There is one book we haven't read. I've been saving it for an emergency. 
<laughs> the very long and very boring story to help sleepy pigs fall asleep. The very long and very boring story to help sleepy pigs fall asleep. Yes, the very long and very boring story to help sleepy pigs fall asleep. Oh. <laughs> Once upon a time, there was a hero named... Super Pepper! <laughs> um, yes, Super Pepper. Whee! She spent all her days helping the people in her neighborhood. Uh-oh. <laughs> Until... One day, she heard about a jumping giant who wouldn't stop shaking the town. The giant won't stop jumping. I'll help you. Super Pepper found the jumping <laughs> giant. Dinosaur. Oh, yes, George, the jumping dinosaur. Super Pepper tried everything she could to stop the jumping dinosaur from jumping. Like asking him very politely. Yes. <laughs> uh, excuse me. Mr. Dinosaur, sir. Excuse me. They tried some bedtime music. This will put him to sleep. <sighs> so relaxing. But the music only gave the dinosaur more energy. Super Pepper tried giving the jumping dinosaur a warm bath. Oh. <laughs> Whoa. She tried giving him cozy pajamas. She even tried counting stars. One, two, three, four, five. That's everything we did. There's nothing left to try. <sighs> The bedtime story has helped George fall asleep. Hooray! Thank you for your help, Pepper. Sweet dreams. Thank you, Daddy Bert. Now I'm not tired. Can you finish the story? Welcome to the ice cream shop. It is a very hot day. So Peppa and George are playing ice cream shop. Here you go, Mr. Daddy Pig. Oh, thank you. What would you like, Mrs. Mummy Pig? I'd like a banana split, please. Hooray! Ah. Ooh. What's a banana split, Granny? <laughs> it's a type of dessert. First, we need to cut a banana in half. Nana! Oh, ho, 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 ho. Now we add ice cream, cherries, and whipped cream. Ah. George <laughs> likes adding the ice cream. Careful, don't squish the banana. <laughs> <laughs> and Peppa really likes mm. adding whipped cream. Whoops. <laughs> 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 Don't forget oh. the cherry on top. Oh. Here is your banana split, Mrs. Mummy Pig. <laughs> this looks delicious. Oh, please could I have a Knickerbocker Glory? Uh -huh. A Knockanori? What's that, madam? <laughs> it's a type of ice cream sundae. Can you only eat them on Sundays? Oh. <laughs> Not that type of Sunday. You can eat them any time. Ah. I'll show you. Uh -huh. We need ice cream, fruit, meringue, and cream. <laughs> Peppa and George add all the ingredients into the glass. Oh. And now you can decorate the top. Yay. Then decorate with wafers, colorful sprinkles, and sauce. Here you are, ah, madam. This looks wonderful. <laughs> now everyone has been served, what kind of ice cream would you two like? Hmm, 
A rainbow ah. one. Rainbow. Peppa and George use lots of different <laughs> coloured ice cream. Pink for strawberry, brown for chocolate, yellow for <laughs> banana. Nana. Then they add their toppings. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Let's mix it all together. Um. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Peppa and George have mixed all the colours together. We've made a mighty puddle. Ah. Not rainbow ice cream. I'm afraid we don't have much ice cream left. All we have is... Vanilla. My favourite. <laughs> Peppa and George like making special ice creams, but they love vanilla ice cream the most. Today, Peppa and her friends are going to the sweet shop. Hello, Miss Rabbit. I'd like to buy everything in the sweet shop, please. Here is my coin. Peppa and her friends each have one coin to buy a sweet with. Here is my coin, too. And mine. And mine. Wow, what a lot of money. But I'm afraid it's not enough to buy everything in the shop. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> One coin is perfect for trying my new sweet making machines, though. <gasps> Just choose a machine, pop your coin in the slot, and push the big red button. Mmm, strawberry laces. Nay, but strawberries are fruits, not sweets. My sweets are made with delicious real fruit. Much tastier and much healthier. Yummy strawberries. They look like hair. <laughs> You're right. I've got a strawberry ponytail. <laughs> <laughs> my turn, my turn. Emily Elephant has found a rainbow lollipop machine. For this machine, you have to push the buttons to choose your favourite fruity flavours. Hmm, yellow banana. Ooh, you love red apples. And pink raspberries. And blue blueberries. And green apples. <laughs> <laughs> you like all the flavours. <laughs> So fruity! <laughs> Look, it's a big binning ball. <laughs> That's a candy floss machine. Why don't you pop your coin in and give it a go? Mm, it tastes like coconut. <laughs> it looks just like you, Susie. And now it looks even more like you. <laughs> <gasps> what is that? Only one way to find out. But I thought this was a sweetie machine, not a money machine. <gasps> Can I use this to buy some real sweeties? You don't need to. That coin is a sweetie pepper. It's a chocolate coin. Chocolate! Hooray! Pepper loves a sweet treat from the sweet shop. Everyone loves a sweet treat from the sweet shop. Today, Pepper and George are helping Daddy Pig tidy some old boxes. <laughs> What's this, Daddy? Ah, that's my trusty old camera, Pepper. You press the button to take a picture. Cheese. And it prints the photo out. Look, I can see it. Can I have a go, please? <laughs> Say cheese. Cheese. Now Peppa is taking photos with the camera. This camera is really fun. Camera. Have fun. But there isn't much photo paper left, so use it wisely. George loves taking lots of photos. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, it's run out of photo paper. Oh, but I love taking pictures. Hmm, 
Why don't we use my phone's camera instead? It can even add filters to a photo. <laughs> Daddy Pig's phone camera has given George a pretend moustache. <laughs> Come on, George. Let's take more photos. Peppa and George are having lots of fun taking pictures. The phone camera has given Mummy Pig a flowery filter. Say cheese. Oh. And Grandpa Pig has a very fine hat. <laughs> Pepper, George and Daddy Pig have come to the park to take even more photos. <laughs> Hello, Mr and Mrs Bird. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh. Cheese! Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> what a funny photo! Daddy Pig wants to take a photo with Pepper and George <laughs> by the ducks. Say cheese, everybody! One, two, three, cheese! <laughs> Pepper and George are sticking all the photos from the day into a scrapbook. Look at this one, George. But some of the photos are blurry. Oh. The photos don't have to be perfect. They just have to remind you of a lovely day. Everyone loves taking photos. And everyone has had a very lovely day. A super strike for a super bowler. Today, Susie Sheep is having a bowling party. <laughs> to get a super strike too. I know how to do it. I've been bowling lots of times. Then you can show everyone what to do, Peppa. OK. We should take our pictures for the scoreboard. <laughs> Just step in front of the camera and say cheese. Cheese! Perfect. This is your bowling lane. Ooh. Now you shoot the bowling ball. Then you throw it straight ahead. Like this. Yay! <laughs> I'm going to try. I like this one. The pink ball is very heavy. <laughs> try this one instead. It's lighter. Whoa. Crikey! Anyone lost a ball? Oh, no. I'll try next. Oh. Pedro Pony's ball has gone into the gutter at the side of the lane. Whoops! My turn. Whoa! <laughs> Susie Sheep, Pedro Pony and Gerald Giraffe haven't quite got the hang of bowling yet. Don't worry. We need to find a better way to play. Hmm. Why don't you try with the barriers up this time? It's another fun way to play. Now you try, Pedro. OK, but I don't want my bowling ball to bounce. No problem. You can use a ramp to help the ball roll in a straight line. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Peppa and her friends are having lots of fun bowling in their own ways. <laughs> but Susie Sheep still wants to get a super strike. All right, everyone. It's your last bowl. Good luck. <laughs> What's this? Susie Sheep is bowling backwards. Oh! <gasps> a super strike for a super bowler! Susie Sheep has got a super strike. Susie Sheep loves bowling. Everyone loves bowling. Four tickets, please! Four popcorns, please! 
four drinks, please. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her family are at the cinema. Peppa's favourite book has been made into a movie. <laughs> Silly George, we're not seeing that scary ghost movie. Ours is really fun and not scary. Scary ghost <laughs> movies are only for grown-ups. Uh, excuse me. Excuse Sorry. me. Uh, <laughs> Sorry. <sighs> <laughs> The seats in the cinema all fold up when they're not being used. But George's seat is folding up when he's sitting in it. Excuse me, coming through. Watch your toes. Luckily, Miss Rabbit has a special booster to hold the seat flat. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Rabbit. No problem. Me again. <gasps> Who spilled popcorn? <laughs> George doesn't like it when the cinema gets dark. Whoosh, whoosh. Yay, it's starting! <gasps> Sorry! <laughs> George doesn't like the loud sounds either. Oh dear, George thinks the baddie in the movie is a bit scary. Maybe we should take George outside. But you can't miss the movie. Oh! Peppa has thought of a way to make the baddie less scary for George. Hello, George, it's me. I'm just pretending to be a buddy for the movie. I'm not really scary. Not Scary? No. And this magic wand oh. will keep you extra safe. Wish! <laughs> Wish! <laughs> Plus, at the end of the story, everyone lives happily ever after. Ooh! Happy! <laughs> Wish! Shh! <gasps> Sorry. Everyone loves going to the cinema, and George really loves movies with happy endings. Today, Peppa and her family are going on the night train to a very far away seaside. It's bedtime now. We can play with the beach ball tomorrow at the beach. But I don't want to go to sleep. Well, we're not going to sleep yet. We're having a sleepover. Yay! Peppa and George <laughs> love sleepovers. Can we have a midnight feast? You need to have a midnight feast at a sleepover, Daddy. It's the rules. Right you are. Follow me. Hooray! <laughs> Everyone has come to the dining carriage to get the midnight feast. Hello. Oh. Hello. What would you like? We'd like a midnight feast, please. One. <gasps> midnight feast coming up. Here you go. Fruit and warm milk. Perfect before a good sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. Everyone tucks into their midnight feast, gives their teeth a good brush, and gets comfy in bed. Can we have a bedtime story? Oh, OK, Peppa. Just one story, and then sleep. Hooray! This is the story of the magic night train. Ooh! Once upon a time, there was a magic night train which didn't need train tracks because it could fly. <gasps> Yay! Woohoo! <laughs> Whee! 
Wonderful dream about a magical night train. Look, we arrived at the seaside. Peppa and her family have arrived at the very far away seaside, and they all enjoyed their train sleepover. Today, Peppa and her family are visiting the botanical garden. <laughs> One's tall. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> These smell lovely. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, and that one is on oh. Daddy's head. <laughs> <laughs> Step right up to the very <gasps> tricky hedge maze. Enter if you dare. What's this, Miss Rabbit? This is a very tricky hedge maze. It's a long, windy path with lots of twisty turns. You have to find the big fountain oh. in the middle. Peppa and George like the sound of the very <laughs> tricky maze. I'm a bit of an expert at mazes. I almost never get lost. <laughs> Good luck. Let's go. Hooray! Peppa and her family are making their way through the maze. It is very windy. Everyone thinks it is very fun indeed. There's nowhere to go. Oh dear. We'll have to go back and try another way, Daddy Pig. Daddy Pig? <gasps> Over here, Mummy Pig. George and I must have taken a wrong turn. Uh-oh. Perhaps we should meet at the fountain in the middle. Good idea. <laughs> Race you! <laughs> <laughs> Peppa and Mummy Pig are having lots of fun in the maze, but Daddy and George are a bit lost. Hmm? <sighs> Not to worry, George. We'll make it, as long as we don't give up. Oh, hello, huh? George. The fountain is that way, by the big leafy flowers. Hooray! Off we go! Everyone has arrived at the centre of the maze. Hooray! Well done. You finished the first bit of the maze very quickly. What's the second bit? Finding your way out, of course. <laughs> Peppa and her family loved going into the very tricky hedge maze and they're really going to love finding their way out again too. Today, Peppa and her playgroup are at a juice factory. Ah. They're learning how juice is made. And this is the fruit squeezer. It squeezes all the juice out of the oranges. Can I try squeezing oranges, Miss Rabbit? Of course. You can all try. Hooray! Everyone is having lots of fun squeezing the oranges. But it is very hard work. <laughs> It's okay, because next up, we have the juice stomper. Oh. The stomper has big boots to stomp out all the juice from the strawberries. Oh, can I try stomping, Miss Rabbit? Yes, everyone can try. Hooray! Pop these boots on and stomp away. <laughs> it's just like jumping. 
<laughs> well done, everyone. Now, follow me. This is where the juice is put into cartons. We have to match the flavour with the picture on the cartons. What flavour is this one? It's red. Is it strawberry? Well done, Mandy. Press the red button to fill it up. <laughs> and how about this one? It's green. So... Apple! <laughs> Spot on, Susie. And this one? It's... Mm. Lots of colour. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Well done, Peppa. You've created a brand new type of juice. It's rainbow juice. <laughs> Everyone thinks the rainbow juice looks very delicious indeed. This is the tasting room. It's where we make sure all the juice tastes scrum diddly umptious. But to make it fun, you have to guess what flavour each juice is. Peppa and her playgroup love tasting <laughs> juice. Ah, yum! This is orange uh -huh. juice. Mmm, <laughs> this is apple juice. Ah. Ah. This tastes like all the juices at once. That's because it's your special... Rainbow <gasps> juice! Yum, yum, yum! Peppa loves learning about juice. And Peppa really loves her delicious rainbow juice. Peppa and her family are flying in an aeroplane. Woohoo! Yay! I love flying in aeroplanes. <laughs> But not everyone loves flying in aeroplanes. <laughs> oh, hello, Madam Gazelle. George and I love flying. <laughs> Do you love it too? Actually, I have never been on an aeroplane before. And I am scared. Huh? Oh. Oh. Hmm. Oh, I know what to do. Miss Rabbit, please can you make the plane go really, really high? I don't see why not. Oh. It's really fun when the plane goes high, Madam Gazelle. Look, we're nearly in space. Oh. Instead, Miss Rabbit. Certainly. Oh! <laughs> oh! Too low! Far too low! Hmm. Let's do a loop de loop. <laughs> I don't think that worked either, George. <gasps> Look, Madam Gazelle, oh. that cloud is shaped like a bird. Do you see? Yes, I see. Ooh. And that one is shaped like a relaxing desert island. Dinosaur! Oh. <laughs> oh, it's no good. I will just close my eyes and wait for this to be over. Oh, dear. Hello. Would you two like an activity book? They're lots of fun. Ooh. Oh, yes, please. Would you like to oh. do some colouring in with us, Madam Gazelle? Well, I suppose that might keep my mind off things. <laughs> and so Peppa, George and Madam Gazelle did some relaxing colouring for the rest of the flight. Look at these! The line work! The attention to detail! Incredible! A star plus! Oh, hooray! We've landed! Whee! 
Already? But I was having fun. That wasn't scary at all. I told you, flying is really fun. Thank you for helping me, Peppa and George. Now I cannot wait to fly home. <laughs> it is morning, and Peppa Aha. is having some delicious breakfast. Oh. What's happened to the cereal? <laughs> April Fools! <laughs> April Fools? What's that? Today is April Fool's Day. It's a day where people make each other laugh by playing silly jokes. Like I just did with your cereal. I like silly jokes. <coughs> Can we do one on Daddy? <coughs> That's a great idea. Daddy Pig is reading on the sofa, but Mummy Pig and Pepper have come to play a joke on him. Could you please pass my glasses, Mummy Pig? Of course. <laughs> Peppa and Mummy Pig are playing a joke on Daddy Pig. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> That's strange. These glasses have made it even harder to see. April, April Fools! Fools. <laughs> <laughs> oh, these are joke glasses. Very funny. But you won't be able to play another joke on me. I am much too clever for that. Peppa <laughs> is playing another joke on Daddy Pig. Oh, no. Huh? I can't open this tube of crisps. Can you help me, Daddy? Of course, Peppa. Hmm? Whoa! Oh, 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 oh. That gave me a fright. <laughs> April, April Fools! <laughs> you got me again, Pepper. Well done. <laughs> Would you like to help me play an April Fool's Day joke on Mummy Pig, Pepper? <laughs> Pepper and her family have finished mm. dinner and are now eating dessert. <laughs> Aha! Me and Pepper have made a tasty chocolate cake for dessert, haven't we, Pepper? Yes. <laughs> How lovely! It looks delicious! <laughs> <laughs> My fork doesn't seem to work. <laughs> Try with your hands. Peppa and Daddy are playing a joke on Mummy Pig. <gasps> this isn't a cake. This is a sponge with icing on it. April, April Fools! Fools. <laughs> 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 what a clever joke. That reminds me. George brought some biscuits for you, Peppa. <laughs> Yay! Thank you, George. I love biscuits. <laughs> April Fools! Peppa <laughs> loves April Fools' Day. Everyone loves April Fools' Day. <laughs> 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 Today, Peppa and her family are visiting the arcade. Well done! You got a high score. That's because Peppa and I are experts at all of these games. Look at all these tokens, Peppa. If you collect lots of these, you can trade them in for a huge prize. Wow, a prize? Squeak! Look at all these tokens! <laughs> can we play that game next? Of course, Peppa. Mummy Pig is showing Peppa how to play Carrot Bop. She is bopping the carrots whenever they pop up. Bop! 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 <laughs> Would you both like to have a go? Yes, please. Bop! Prize, Daddy. Daddy? <laughs> Daddy Pig is playing the dancing game. Daddy Pig loves dancing. Wow. I'm a bit of an expert 
At dancing, you know. Your turn, Pepper. <laughs> I know just the game. <laughs> Pepper and her family are playing a balloon game. Whoever fills their balloon with water first wins. Did we get another high score? Yes, your score was so high that you have all won the jackpot. Now you can trade in all your tokens for a huge prize. Hello again, Peppa. Here are all our tokens. Can we please have our prize? Of course. With this many tokens, you can get a marvellous, extraordinary, one-of-a-kind pencil. Hooray! A pencil! Peppa loves winning lots of tokens with her family at the arcade. And Peppa really loves her brand new pencil. Today, Peppa is playing with her toy blocks. <gasps> Oop! Careful, George. This is a very small town and you're a very giant dinosaur. That gives me an idea. Do you want to play giants, George? <laughs> George is very excited to play Giants with Peppa. Hello, Police Officer Panda. What a lovely, quiet, normal day in Toyland. <laughs> and definitely no sign of... <gasps> Hello, I am Giant Peppa. <gasps> a giant! Two giants! <laughs> Peppa and George are imagining their giants in a pretend <laughs> toy block world. Hello, birds! Hello, clouds! <laughs> <gasps> Hello, everyone! <gasps> Bear, our ball is stuck in that very tall tree. We can help you with that. We are very tall giants. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Whoopsie. <laughs> oh, careful, George. <laughs> there you go, Susie. Hooray! <laughs> giant Pepper and Giant George love to help their friends in Thailand. <gasps> They help the passengers Whee! to get on the bus. Oh, wee! 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 <laughs> and help the boats go very, very fast. <laughs> Stop! <gasps> it's the bridge you broke earlier. Oh. Don't worry. We can fix it! <laughs> Peppa and George are experts with toy blocks. They fix the toy bridge in no time at all. Thanks, Giant Peppa and Giant George! Stop! Uh, I mean, go! Hooray! 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 Oh, goody! Hungry. I'm hungry too. The food in Toyland is too small for Giant Pepper and Giant George. Whoa! Dinner time! Hooray! So they will have to have real food instead. Careful, George! <laughs> Hello, everybody! <laughs> Today, Pepper and her family have come to a concert of Madame Gazelle's band. The Rocking Gazelles. I can't see anything. How about now? Hooray! Thank you. <laughs> oh dear. Gerald Giraffe is also on his daddy's shoulders and is blocking everyone's view. Oh, hi, Peppa. 
Hi, George. Gerald and his daddy have moved to the side, so now everyone can see. With a one and two and one, two, three, four. Yay! Everyone is having a wonderful time. Peppa and Daddy Pig are really enjoying the music. Are you having fun, Peppa? Yes! Are you having fun, George? George? Peppa and Daddy Pig have accidentally ended up in the middle of the crowd. We'll come and find you soon, Mummy Pig. What? I said we'll come and find you soon. But I don't need a spoon. Have fun, George. Whee! Everyone is dancing. It's like being in a big dancing swimming pool. Ho, ho, ho. There are even some inflatable beach balls. Got it. Well done, Peppa. Thank you. Thank you. <gasps> oh. Oops. Sorry, Mr. Bull. Sorry, Madam Gazelle. Not to worry. Happens all the time. That's okay. I love pop music. In fact, it reminds me of my next song. One, two, three, four. Hop, hop, hopping bubbles, hopping bubbles, popping away. Hop, hop, hopping bubbles, hopping bubbles all day. Hop, hop, hopping bubbles, hopping bubbles, hopping, bubbles, hopping away. Mummy and George Pig have danced all the way to the front of the concert, too. Madame Gazelle has invited Peppa and her family to join them on stage. <laughs> hop, hop, hopping bubbles, hopping bubbles, hopping away. Hop, hop, hopping bubbles, popping bubbles, popping bubbles all day. Hooray! Yay! Everyone loves Madame Gazelle's concert, and everyone really loves pop pop popping bubbles. Oh. <laughs> Peppa and Susie Sheep have decided to oh. wear their clothes backwards today. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, Susie. Goodbye, Peppa. Oh. Hmm. Peppa, Susie, why are you wearing your clothes backwards? <laughs> oh. <laughs> and why are you walking backwards? Because today is backwards day. You say and do everything backwards. <laughs> no, we don't. <laughs> <laughs> and Susie Sheep are chasing each other around the garden backwards. <laughs> You're it! Try to catch me! <laughs> it's very difficult to play games backwards. Where did you go, Susie? Oops. Coming! <laughs> oh. I know! Let's play backwards in the park! <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Bull is very confused to see Peppa and oh. Susie Sheep skipping backwards. Good morning. Why are you going backwards? It's backwards day. We have to do everything backwards. Is it backwards day already? <laughs> I'd better get my backwards drills ready. <laughs> oh. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. Whoops! Sorry! Peppa and Susie Sheep spend Backwards Day playing in the park. Backwards swinging feels the same as forwards. But not all the games are as fun backwards. This is backwards! No, this is backwards. Let's play backwards frisbee. Catch! <laughs> Who would like an ice cream? Yay! Oops, we mean no! no! Oh! <laughs> 
I see you're having a fun backwards day. Ah, <laughs> I'm going to eat my ice cream backwards. Oops. <laughs> Upside down isn't quite the same as backwards. It's all very confusing. I think backwards day might be be over now. Peppa and Susie <laughs> Sheep enjoyed Backwards Day, but they're very glad that things aren't backwards anymore. Today, Peppa and her playgroup are doing a fun run to raise money for a new school bell. Is everybody ready to run? Ready! Okay, on your marks, get set, go! <laughs> oh, oh dear, it has started to rain and nobody wants to run in the rain. Should we do the race another day when it's not so cloudy and rainy? Except for Pepper. But the rain will make the fun run even more fun. There'll be so many oh. muddy puddles. Yay! All right. That means on your marks again, get set again, and go again. <laughs> <laughs> the rain has made a small puddle on the running track. But Rebecca Rabbit is very good at jumping. I did it! <laughs> oh. Oops! <laughs> Sorry, Rebecca. <laughs> That's okay, Peppa. Oh. Oh. Come along, you two. Lots of race to go. <laughs> the wind is making it hard for Susie and Mummy Sheep to climb the hill. <laughs> the wind is too strong. And the hill is too slippery. Aha! Emily Elephant is very good at pulling things with her trunk. The way down looks very muddy. Yep, so it's fun to slide down. And Whee! Peppa is very good at sliding in the mud. Whee! <laughs> Whee! <laughs> Peppa and Daddy Pig have arrived at the big trees. Everyone must crawl under the low branches to finish the race. <laughs> that does look fun. <laughs> Everyone has made it to the finish line. We have raised enough money to fix the school bell! Hooray! Oh! Mr. Bull will fix it tomorrow. Hooray! Did you have fun, Daddy? Daddy? Everyone loves running in the rain. Come on, Peppa. We're going again. But Daddy Pig really <laughs> loves running in the rain. Today, Peppa and her class are going on a school trip. Hello, everyone. Who's ready for a school trip in my lovely new yellow bus? Oh! oh what happened to your old blue bus, Miss Rabbit? It broke down at the weekend whilst I was taking a nice, relaxing drive. Oh dear! Miss Rabbit's bus is unable to race! So it's in the garage for some small repairs. That bus is going to need some big repairs. <laughs> Peppa and her friends have never been on a big yellow bus before. Seatbelt check! Check. Then off we go! <laughs> Whoops! Let's try again. Miss Rabbit isn't used to driving the yellow bus. The yellow bus is a bit fast for Madame Gazelle. The yellow 
Bus can do lots of things. It can do this, this, oh. this, oh. and of course, this. The yellow bus can play music very loudly. Could we turn the music down a little bit? Of course, Madam Gazelle. Aww. Why don't we sing a song instead? The yellow bus wheels go round and round. Round and round, round and round. round, and round. The yellow bus wheels go round, round and round all day long. Play I Spy. Good idea. I spy with my little eye. Something beginning with R. Road. Nope. <coughs> Rabbit. Nope. It's a really big lorry. Oh. Hello, Mr. Ball. Hello. Peppa's playgroup have arrived for their school trip, so it's time to get off the bus. Oh! I wish we could stay on the yellow bus all day. Don't worry, I'll be back in the bus to take you all home later. Everyone likes riding in the big yellow bus. Everyone except Madam Gazelle. <laughs> Tonight, George is having a sleepover with Edmund Elephant and Richard Rabbit. All right, everyone. Time for bed. Don't worry, Mummy. I'll make sure they all go to sleep. Thank you, Peppa. <laughs> Come on, then. Into your sleeping bags. Quick march. Peppa likes being in charge. Well done, Peppa. Good night, everyone. Night. Night. <laughs> Only joking. Huh? You can't go to sleep yet. There's lots of fun things you have to do first. <gasps> George has never had a sleepover before. He is very excited. First, we have to have a midnight feast. Ah! Ooh. Oh, you've turned into ghosts. <laughs> <laughs> I know a spooky story about ghosts. George, Richard and Edmund love stories. This is a ghost story about a muddy puddle that wasn't muddy. Ahem! Paranormal apparitions, or ghosts as they're commonly known, do not exist. It is scientifically impossible. Edmund is a clever clogs. He doesn't believe in ghosts. Can I tell a story? Um, OK. <coughs> Ahem. Once upon a time, there was a giant pig Roar! and a, a very small rabbit. Squeak, squeak, squeak! And they chased each other forever <laughs> and ever. <laughs> That was a good story. Oh, I've got another one. This one is about... George, Edmund and Richard have turned into ghosts again. <laughs> Silly George. <sighs> oh, do you know what's next? Yay! We have to stay up very late until... <sighs> um... 100 o'clock. Ready? Oh. I don't think George understands sleepovers. <laughs> How's everything going, Peppa? They're fast asleep, Mummy. Well done. I think you've earned a midnight feast. Hooray! George and his friends like playing sleepover games, but they love to sleep. <laughs> Today, Peppa and George are playing in the sand pit. <laughs> Peppa is playing with toy cars. She has a fire engine, an ambulance, 
a digger and... George, where's the police car? The police car is lost in the sand. Where did you put it, George? <coughs> police car? <coughs> it's OK. We'll find it together. It'll be... Aha! An oh. adventure! Peppa and George are pretending they are in a big sandy <laughs> desert. Let's take the fire engine. <laughs> Whee! Whee! <laughs> Whee! Whee! <laughs> Peppa and George are using the fire engine to search the sand. Have a drink. Whee! Lucky the hose is full of orange juice. <laughs> Peppa and George love orange juice. <sighs> Come on, we still need to find the police car. Hmm. Hmm. <gasps> Over there. That sounds like. <gasps> Please, car! I told you we'd find it! Yay! Adventure! <laughs> now we just have to dig it out! <gasps> beep, 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 beep! <laughs> uh, this is going to take forever! Aha! Where are you going, George? <laughs> You've turned into a giant! <laughs> Pepper and George have found the police car. Nino, Nino, me! Is George? Um, hmm. But it looks like they'll have to go on another adventure <laughs> to find the digger. <laughs> Ooh. And that's how you play shuffleboard. My puck landed at the bottom, so I get one point. Hooray! Today on the cruise, Peppa and her family are learning to play shuffleboard. Now, Grandpa Pig can either knock my puck away or slide his into the triangle and get points. Let's give it a go. Grandpa Pig has knocked Granny Pig's puck into George's sand. That's two points for me. Can I try next? Yes, use this cue stick and push the puck into the triangle. Hmm. Ugh. Oh, it didn't move very much. Why don't you try giving yourself a running start? Good idea. Peppa is taking a big oh. runner. But the sand oh. is very slippery. <laughs> I didn't get any points. Not to worry. It's about having fun, not scoring points. Besides, no one is an expert their first time. <laughs> well Good done, show. George. I'll <laughs> just have to keep trying. <laughs> Pepper is trying lots of different ways of sliding the puck. <laughs> Whoa! My ice cream! Aha! Uh -huh. uh -huh. But oh. nothing seems to be working. Ah! <laughs> uh. Ah! Uh. Ah! Uh. Ah! Uh. Oh. At least you missed my ice cream cone this time. Whoa! <laughs> Oh, dear. My turn, Peppa. Here you go, Granny. <sniffs> ah. 
Granny's puck has pushed Peppa's puck into the triangle. I got three points! Hooray! Peppa <laughs> is very excited to keep practising. But there are no pucks left to play with. Oh. <laughs> George has used them to complete his sandcastle. Everyone <laughs> loves playing shuffleboard, but George loves making sandcastles even more. Tonight, Mummy and Daddy Pig are going out for a Valentine's Day meal. Uh -huh. Mummy Pig has ordered a taxi. <gasps> it's almost here! Hooray! Hooray! Oh. Oh. Your ride awaits, madam. <gasps> oh. um. Mummy Pig has accidentally ordered a special taxi called a limousine. <laughs> A limo! How romantic! And Whoa. tickly! <laughs> Where are we off to, sirs and madams? Granny and Grandpa Pig's house, if you please, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> Pepper and George are going there for dinner. Dinner! <laughs> <laughs> OK, calm down, you two. This music reminds me of Venice. <laughs> what a wonderful trip that was. <gasps> <gasps> now it's a disco Yay! limo! <laughs> <Yay>! Oh! <laughs> we didn't have this in Venice. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Care for a oh. chocolate, Mummy Pig? Mm -hmm. Oh, don't mind if I can. Can we have some, Daddy? Chocolate! <laughs> um, OK, but not too many. Oh. Peppa and George love chocolate. <laughs> Maybe a little too much. <laughs> I guess I'll have this one, then. <laughs> Can we have the disco music again? Just until Granny and Grandpa's house, please. <laughs> oh, yeah! Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hi! Happy Disco Valentine's Day, everyone! We. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, we're having a Valentine's Day disco. <laughs> 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 It's just like that time in Paris, Grandpa Pig. Everyone <laughs> loves celebrating Valentine's Day, but Mummy and Daddy Pig love their disco limo ride most of all. Peppa, have you decided what you're giving away to the charity shop? Yes, all of this. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Today, Peppa is giving some of her toys and clothes to a charity shop. This is called donating. <gasps> Away we go! Whee! <laughs> charity shops sell donated items Aww. and use the money to help people. Great! Do you want to help me sell them? Yes, please! I'll help by shopping. <laughs> Peppa is excited for people to buy her old things. <gasps> oh. But no one is buying them. No one is buying any of the things I donated, Miss Rabbit. Not to worry. We just need to let people know they're available to buy. <laughs> like this. Do you like <gasps> toy rabbits, Police Officer Panda? Yes. Did you want to buy this one? <gasps> I do. <gasps> Thank you. Why don't you try, Peppa? <gasps> I'm a bit cold, <gasps> Mummy. Would you like to buy this jumper, Susie? It's very warm and woolly and cosy. <laughs> yes. 
Please, I love wool. Bonjour, Miss Rabbit. I'm looking for a gift for somebody who loves sports. <gasps> hmm. I know. Hmm. <gasps> Cat. Oh, this is perfect. Thank you. Oh. Peppa wants to sell her <laughs> toy bus next, but there's no one left to sell to. There's no one left in the shop, Miss Rabbit, except <gasps> Mummy. Let's put it in the window display so everyone outside can see it. Yay! Hello there. Look at this toy bus. Would you like to buy it? No one can hear Pepper from outside the shop. <gasps> the big real bus looks just like Pepper's little toy bus. <gasps> We have the same bus. Ah. Maybe it'll sell tomorrow, Peppa. <gasps> Yay! Excuse me, is that toy bus for sale? <gasps> Why, yes it is. Would you like to buy it? I would <laughs> love to buy it. I love all buses. Big and small. Hooray! Peppa loves the charity shop. Everyone <gasps> loves the charity shop. <laughs> <laughs>